you guys are looking to buy FIFA coins with fast delivery and cheap prices or open up FIFA packs on a brand new website for real coin totals, check out FIFACoinZone.com and use the code HABER to get yourself 5% off. It is a brisk, very nippy Thursday morning. But we do have rewards, which is very good. Now, before we get into rewards, just a quick question for the comments for you guys. Uh, how are you guys looking on these uh, these objectives? I am very interested to know because, um, as you see, I've done zero for Milinkovic Savage, and I've done one for Boateng, and I've done zero for Guarin. And I want to make it very clear, I've played like eight deficient games. <laughs> I can't do it. It's so difficult, even with Ronaldo in my squad, because people are just playing drop back and passing the ball around the back of the minute they score. It's absolutely crazy. So, oh, even with a pay-to-win disgusting god squad like mine, I am not enjoying Viva right now and I'm having a really awful time with it. So I wanted to ask you guys what, how it's going for you. I don't really like playing Division 1 um, for objectives and I just wish that EA wouldn't give us objectives for Division Rivals. I know they're trying to get us to play Division Rivals. Every, everything possible they're doing right now for, to get us to play Division Rivals, they're doing. I'm not entirely sure why, but it is what it is. Anyway, we've got Division Rival Rewards. We have got ourselves two Ultimate Packs for finishing in uh, Rank 2 Division 1, which is very exciting. My first ever Division 1 Rewards, and I'm very excited for it. So two Ultimate Packs uh, uh, sorry, secured for that. Now, we also finished in Gold 1 Rewards. I finished 20 and 6, and I'm not entirely sure where my rewards are right now. You aren't going to try it. Don't even try and make me wait until 9am. Oh my word, we're going to have to wait until 9am. I could have stayed in bed another hour. I'm I'm furious. I actually woke up with like four hours sleep. I could have just stayed in bed for an hour. I hate... <sighs> See you in an hour. Let's try that again. It's been an hour. <laughs> we're at currently 8.59am. I totally forgot the clocks even changed. And you know what? Totally missed out on an extra hour in bed, which I need this morning. I don't know what it is about this morning. I'm just very tired. Hopefully we can wake ourselves up with a good pack pool in some division rivals or foot champs rewards. I'm excited. We've obviously got a couple of hundred and twenty-five K packs waiting already. Um, and we've got the champs rewards as well, which I'm a little bit good because you guys really enjoy the content. You guys really love um you guys really love the videos, uh the foot champs reward videos and stuff like that. I would love to be able to save my packs. Um, but sadly that is just not an option because obviously you guys enjoy watching the content and I want to bring you guys the content every single week. So what I was going to say earlier is we finished 20 to 6 in foot champs. Easily, easily should have lost maybe like four less games. Um, you ever just have those games where you lose your head and you think, what is the point in continue playing? You know, I had a lot of those games this weekend. Anyway, we finished 20 and 6. The reason I didn't play my last four is because my elite foot champs rewards look is absolutely doo doo. Uh, so there's no point in me playing to get uh, one less 100k pack when I feel like I've got more of a chance of getting some good than 100k pack. But we've got two player picks, two red player picks. In terms of the team of the week, the plays I would very much like right now. Uh, any of the high rated ones, of course, like Marquinhos or Aspas. Robertson would be perfect because I'd then be able to sell my Alexandro. Um, Party would be fantastic as a super sub. Milinkovic Savage would be fantastic as a super sub. And Didi would be decent as a super sub. Uh, and again, any of the other high rated ones for future SBCs down the line would be great. But honestly, Robertson is my main one that I would love. He would be fantastic for me. And of course, we're starting off really high rated with uh, with a Hubner. We're going to go for an 82 rated Hubner. Huge pool right there. Just glad. I'm very glad that we've got this really big pool right there. Um, that is absolutely amazing. What an amazing start to the Reds. And we're probably going to get something even higher rated than that. <laughs> yes, come on. Oh, I wasn't expecting that at all. They caught me off guard. EA, I'm so grateful. I'm so grateful. This card looks really, really good. Now, the only the, the, the downside for, for Robertson, in my eyes, is 64 jumping, 72 strength. But I feel like he's going to be really good, no matter what. And I'm very excited. EA, thank you. You gave me a decent red card for once. This is the first usable red card I've had all year. Come on. I wasn't expecting that at all, as you probably guessed my rea by my reaction. Um, I'm probably going to sell Headliner Sandro on. I love Headliner Sandro. However, um, 
to be honest, uh, I need the coins, as you can see. So I'm gonna have to sell him on, I think. But I'm I'm in a good mood right now. That that's amazing, and I wasn't expecting that at all. That completely caught me off guard. So I mean, that's pretty dope. Anyway, we've got two Ultimate packs now. Come on, EA. Let's see something big from the Ultimate packs. Come on. What's it gonna be? First one's a walkout. That's always a great start. It's gonna be an inform walkout. What's it gonna be? Spanish goalkeeper. I thought it might have been. For a second there, I thought we might have just got hit ourselves like an Iago Aspas, which would have been huge. But it's going to be Gaita or Gaita. I don't know how to say his name. Uh, a for a goalkeeper in form is fantastic because he'll be great for SBCs and whatnot. Um, so I'm I'm happy about that. That is actually a really nice pull. Anything else in the pack? Go on, be somewhat decent. Go on. We got Hazard there, but not not the good Hazard. Um, got like 184, 183. It's actually not a great 125k pack, to be honest. If it wasn't for the walkout in form, that would be a really bad pack. Um, but you know what? We'll take it. I'm glad we've got an 84, 80 in form. He's gonna he's gonna make uh, life easy for um for SBCs and whatnot. So that's decent. Second ultimate pack, 125k pack for uh, for rank two in Division One rivals. Let's see what we can get. Come on. It's not, I wasn't expecting a walkout, to be honest. I, I was expecting to get a non-walkout after that. Uh, it's going to be Spanish striker, at least. Diego Costa, maybe? Yeah, it's 85 Diego Costa. Decent. We'll take any of the high rated. They're always nice. Um, I'll take an 85. That's always a nice thing to get, I feel like. So uh, so that's pretty decent. Anything else in the pack? Anything? Ooh, ooh. Okay, a couple 84s in there. A couple 83s. Not too bad, to be fair. Pretty decent. I'm, I'm, I'm happy with that. I'm pretty satisfied with that. Um, we've also got ourselves, I think these are all duplicate and tradables, aren't they? Great, okay, that's just amazing. That's just amazing to get. But you know what, we'll take that, that's decent. Now we've got the two 100k packs from Champs. These are tradable, so hopefully we can get ourselves something decent from one of these. Come on, EA, please. Let's see something decent. Walk out, come on, that's amazing. What a start. What's it going to be? It's going to be normal. What's it going to be? Argentinian. Center back. Okay, it's going to be Otamendi. Don't actually know how much Otamendi is currently going for. 86 rated though. Um, the mid icon SBC is currently gone. So I don't know if he's going to be going for a whole lot anymore. Uh, but that's decent though. We'll take a walkout. Oh, two walkouts in one pack. That's actually pretty lit. That's, that's lit. That's really good. Okay, so he's about 20,000 coins. I'm guessing Muller is roughly the same. That is pretty sick. That is actually a really, really good pack. All right, we'll take that. We will take that. Thank you very much, EA. Anything else there? No, we've got Davies. But you know what? That is actually really, really good. I'm very happy with that. We'll take that. Come on. Okay, I'm happy with that. Right, we've got another 100k pack. Let's see if we can get something good from it. Not bad to buy walkouts, but we got two in the last one, so I'm not complaining at all. I'm happy with that return. Uh, it's going to be Portuguese goalkeeper. At least it's the 84 goalkeeper. Um, that could have been a lot worse, but it's going to be Anthony Lopez. I'm happy with that. You know what? That's pretty decent. Very successful, in my opinion. We've had ourselves a walkout in form. We got ourselves, in my opinion, the best red this week. So uh, I'll happily take that. And uh, obviously, rating-wise, he's not, but I think that, like... I don't know if value-wise he is. I feel like he should be value-wise. Let me quickly double-check how much he's worth. 310k. Oh, he's easily the most the the the, the best value-wise. Yeah, he's master. He's easily the best value-wise. Yeah, he's definitely the best in form this week. We got the best one. I'm very happy about that. Um, so that that's that that's pretty satisfying, and uh, he'll go straight into my team. So we've also got some reds to open from Sam, and we've also got um, Simon's rewards to open as well. So let's go ahead and open up those. All right, we're only going to open up Sam's Reds because he's now going to be saving packs for Team of the Season. He finished in Gold 1, which, again, in my opinion, is better off just to save a couple hundred K packs as opposed to 100K pack and one Team of the Week pack. That is just my personal opinion. But we have, of course, the two red player picks to open up for him. Uh, he sent me a list of the players he would like in order. Let me quickly double check. So he goes, uh, he wants um, Robertson, Marquinhos, Party, Aspas, Poulsen, Zapata, uh, Milinkovic, Savic, and then rating. So, let's see if we can get himself uh, Robertson like we got me. And the first one's going to be Gator. We'll take it. Uh, a greater Gator. I actually don't know how to say this guy's name. Let me know down below. Um, actually, was a pretty decent goalkeeper for me at the start of the year. So, uh, that's not too bad. That's not too shabby. We'll take that. Uh, A4 raid, of course, for SBCs. Not too bad. And then the second red pick for Sam. Can we get him one of the decent ones? Zapata's not bad. That is actually not too bad. 
87 rated. We'll go ahead and take that. That's pretty decent. Um, all round, in my opinion, not a bad card. 74 stamina really lets him down. Apart from that, 92 finishing, 92 head and accuracy, 89 jumping, 99 strength, being six foot two. Probably going to be really good as a very, very late on impact sub. So there, Sam's reds. Uh, I'm hopeful. I hope that he's, he's fairly satisfied with that. Let's go ahead and open up Simon's rewards now. Now for Simon's rewards. Simon's currently sat on 3.1 million coins, and this is his amazing team that he uses in foot champs and in weekend league. Uh, no, I'm just kidding. Uh, let me actually have a look at what, what Simon's team is currently looking like. I think it's this team. Um, yeah, it is. So uh, he sold him, he sold his team of the year Mbappe, which in my opinion is probably the the, the silliest thing he could have done because team of the year Mbappe is the best card in this game without a shadow of a doubt in my opinion. Um, but it's a nice team. It's a nice team nonetheless. I am a big fan of it. Uh, obviously, he's got that untradeable Neymar, which we packed him all that time ago. That is still... That's one of the most popular videos on my channel now, which is pretty crazy. So, we've got division rivals. Where did Simon finish? He finished in rank three. Didn't even go for rank two. Surprising that. Very surprising if you ask me. Rank three though. We'll, t we'll go ahead and take the uh, the 50k packs and the 35k packs. Then we have got foot champions which as you guys will see Simon finished in elite one. Very nice indeed. Two premium team of the week packs, two jumbo rare players packs, 125k and three player picks as well. So we've got a right back to right wing back. We'll go ahead and store that because the amazing objectives allow us to get a right wing back to a right back card. First player pick. I really want to get him something decent. Yeah, come on. Let's get him some good stuff. Party's a great start. Party's a fantastic start. He's actually a really, really nice looking card. Six foot one with 88 jumping, 91 stamina, 84 strength. Um, decent defending stats. Decent shooting stats as well with long shots. Um, nice passing stats. Nice dribbling stats. Overall, just a really nice well-rounded card, I think. Especially for coming off on the bench. I just think it's going to be a really good impact sub. Um, so that's a really nice card. Second player pick now. Come on, EA. Let's see something good. Come on. 88 Marquinhos. Oh my word. We got the highest rated one. We got the highest rated one. So we got the best one in my rewards and the highest rated one on Simon's. That's actually fantastic. Oh my word. What else we got? Come on, EA. And 87 Zapata. That, that is actually unbelievable in my opinion. Uh, an 87, an 88, and an 86 in Elite 1 is very unheard of in my opinion you really don't see amazing rewards like that very often so that is fantastic i'm happy because simon's got really decent rewards there for sbcs and whatnot let's go ahead and open up the uh, rivals and champs rewards and see if we can get ourselves anything decent from the rivals and champ rewards i hope we can just make this a, a, a home run in terms of uh, in terms of of pack look on simon's account today because his pack look is usually rigged and, you know, he's proving that there. So uh, let's see if we can just enhance that and get even more good pack luck. We're going to get ourselves... Uh, go on. Ah, it's Kramer. I thought it might have been Mandzukic. We're going to get ourselves an 83, though, in the first pack. In the, the first mega pack. Not too bad. Great start, to be honest. Uh, two 83s, actually. Not bad. That's a very good start. That is actually a really good start. All right, we'll take that. Decent first mega pack. Let's see what we can get in the second one. Come on here. Let's see some good stuff. Let's see some good stuff. We've got a walkout in the second mega, pack, second mega pack. It's an icon again. Oh, my God. Dutch goalkeeper. Oh, my God. It's another icon. Oh, my God. This happened last week. This happened last week from Division 1 rewards in the mega pack. We packed an icon last week or maybe the week before that. And we just packed another icon in the mega pack. Oh, my God. That's an... I, I'm, my my reaction right now is is really is really uh, what's the word really toned down because it's it's quite early and I don't want to wake anyone up. But that is unreal. We've just packed ourselves another icon. Oh my word! I'm actually in shock. 89 Van der Sar. Obviously, he's going to be only going in SBC, but that is absolutely nuts. That is nuts. That is nuts. From amazing red picks to 80. Nine Van der Sar. We've also got a load more packs to open. Oh my word. That is unbelievable. That is unbelievable. All right, let's see what we can get from the rest of these packs. I won't be surprised if we get absolutely nothing now. That is unbelievable. That's the 14th icon I have personally packed this year. The 14th. That is crazy. That is also, I think, like the sixth one from rewards or the fifth one from the re rewards or something, which is just nuts. Oh my word. Alright. We've got an inform in the 50k pack. What are we gonna get? 
It's going to be, oh, I thought it might have been Ndidi. It's going to be the right mid from uh, from the Belgian League. It's going to be uh, Dennis. 94 peso, not a bad card. That is unreal. That is another untradeable icon of packed from rewards. That is that is just crazy. That, in my opinion, is just absolutely crazy. So we've got two 100k packs now from Champs, two premium team of the week packs. Let's see what we can get from Champs. Come on, EA. Let's see something good. First one's going to be a walkout. Come on. What's it going to be? It's going to be a normal walkout. What are we going to get? It's going to be German. Left wing, Sane, not bad. That is actually pretty decent. We'll take that, 86 rated Sane. Decent pull right there. I still remember when he used to be over 100k, but, you know, he's still like, he's at about 25, 30k now. That's not too bad, though. We've got an 84 Jimenez in there as well, and a Malcolm. Go ahead and store him on the transfer list. What else have we got? We're going to A3 Mandana. We discard the other two players. Not too shabby. We've got another pack here in a Jumbo Rare Plays pack as well. Another 100k pack. Come on, EA. No back to back walkouts for us today, though. What's it going to be? It's going to be a board drop, though. 85, maybe? Ah, it's going to be 84 Hideki. I mean, we'll take it. There's a couple 84s in there. It's not going to be too bad. Uh, anything's decent for SBCs and whatnot. I still can't believe we just packed an icon, to be honest. Another one. Another icon. That is absolutely unreal. Jeez, man. All right. We've got no no more boards in there. We've got two premium team of the week packs, though. Come on, EA. Let's see. Let's see Robertson. Let's see that info, Mandy Robertson. Let's see like a Milinkovic Savage. Let's see like a Poulsen or an Iago Aspas or a Marquinhos or a, or a party. Come on, EA. Let's see someone good. First one's not even going to be a walkout, man. This is why I don't finish Elite. Because this is my Elite Foot Champs pack every single time. This is this is my Elite uh, Premium Team of the Week pack every single time I finish Elite. It's going to be this like no board 82 rated. Every time it's without fail, it's the same thing. This is why I don't like finishing Elite, and I, f I prefer finishing in uh, in Gold 1. Because a couple of walkouts in Gold 1, in my opinion, is better. Um, but we've got another uh, Premium Team of the Week pack now to end off the video. It's going to be a walkout in this one. Let's see that Scottish flag. Come on, EA. Let's see the Scottish flag. Who? Uh, Dabur. <laughs> that threw me off. I saw the blue, and I was like, oh, and then I was like, wait, hang on. That isn't the Scottish flag. I was like, I know I'm tired, but I'm not that tired. It's going to be Dad Boar. At least it's a walkout to end it off, I guess. A two in one pack would be nice. Two walkouts. Hey, we actually did. We got Ben Me. I think that's Ben Me. Yeah, Ben Me. I always get them mixed up. Um, we'll take that, though. Happy days, happy days. Two walkouts and Ben Me in the last one. Um, that has been unbelievably successful very 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 successful i'm very happy about that if you have enjoyed leave a like down below subscribe to the channel if you guys are new around here thank you for watching and i'll see you lads later